Hey guys, I'm back with another fast video. It's about macros. I kept talking about macros in my last couple of videos and I just wanted to explain what that was all about. Um, so I made a video, made pretty much a slideshow, but I'm gonna do a voiceover with a little bit of me yapping at the mouth, talking, you know what I mean? Uncomplacent, you know how we doing it. So yeah. Uh, my weight loss journey still going. It's going pretty good. Lost a couple pounds this week so far, but I'm going to do an update after Sunday. I'll go Sunday to Sunday, do my way in. Um, I use some examples in this video, and they're only examples. They're not for everybody. They're just broad numbers, just so you can see how macros can be uh, manipulated and fitted into your own diet. Um, you will have to do some research to figure out your own maintenance calories to see where you are um, and just see where you need to be. So um, I'm just going to give you some general information. Hope it helps um, and hope you like this video. Please subscribe so you can see when I come back again with another one. All right. See you soon. Peace. All right, guys, as promised, here's your video on macros. Um, and as you can read along and see what I'm talking about, fats, carbs, and protein are basically the three macros we're going to talk about. Um, so fats, that's basically, you know, you got healthy, you got unhealthy fats, but you need them for your body every day. Um, so I'll give you a list of a few healthy ones that I chose, but obviously there's many more out there. Here's the list, as you can see. But you have to do your own research to find the ones you like, the ones you don't like. Everybody's different. Here's carbs. Um, and obviously, you know, those sugars are not healthy for us. You want those slow burning carbs. That's going to help you. And the ones with high fiber, it's going to be more beneficial. Now, these are a few of the ones that you do not want to have. As you can see, this stuff, obviously, all of it tastes amazing. And here's the ones that you do want to have. And with a little doctoring up, you can make these taste amazing too. They can still be good for you. Um, I mean, they are good for you, but they can still taste good. Protein, we know that's the building block of muscle. That's what you need. Stay strong. Get that lean muscle. Um, building chain. Amino acids. Uh, here's a few sources. Eggs, you can see it, beans. Let's try to stay away from processed meats. Um, so if you want to count your macros, as you can see, one gram of fat is nine calories, one gram of carbs, four, and one gram of protein is four. So as you eat your calories, all these things, they add up. And I'm going to show you an example of a 2,000 calorie day, if that's what you chose. You would break them up in percentages, and figure out your how much of each you would like to take in and if that fits you these are the numbers so you can see you would only want 44 grams of fats if you did this percentage and this is totally adjustable so all of this works different for everybody you have to figure these out for yourself individually so with that being said you need to figure it out your cal calor caloric needs and then you know take away 500 if you want to lose weight add some if you want to build muscle so with all this being said all you need to do is get started all you need to do is do it let's do it 